Hi, welcome back to the Circuit Playground Express online workshop. In this section, we're going to learn about programming your Circuit Playground with JavaScript. Now, if you've been using MakeCode, you're probably familiar with JavaScript. At least you've clicked over to the JavaScript side to see where you can program it. But I'd like to go into a little bit more detail about what JavaScript has to offer. So JavaScript is a really widely used programming language, primarily in web browsers, because that's the programming language that all web browsers use. But it's not used very much within the maker industry or in other areas. It can be used to program anything from games to Internet of Things items to even circuit boards like the Circuit Playground Express. It's just a little less common to see it in that area. But it's a really easy programming language to learn, and it can be intuitive for a new person who's breaking into programming. So let's take a look at what it looks like in, in, uh, in MakeCode. So I've got an example up here where I've set up an event for the but a button A click and a button B click. And if we head over to the JavaScript side, we can see what that looks like within JavaScript. And we can program anything we like in JavaScript. We can make create our entire sketch in JavaScript here. And one of the nice things about it is we keep all the functionality of the virtual Circuit Playground Express that MakeCode offers so we can test out our code in real time. And we can grab blocks of code from the menu op options and drop them in. So rather than needing to look up what we want for, let's say, a rainbow animation, and then we'll set all the lights to zero, we can drag and drop kind of like the blocks to really speed up the process of, of programming. And it's kind of like, kind of acts as kind of like a cheat sheet for for learning the different elements of JavaScript as they apply to the Circuit Playground Express. And that allows you to program as quickly and as easily, I would say, as with the drag and drop blocks, once you have a little bit of familiar familiarity with how the code works. So if you're looking to start programming with an actual programming language for your Circuit Playground, using JavaScript within MakeCode makes the transition really easy and gives you all the help you need to start learning how to code in an actual programming language. Stick around, in the next section, we'll talk about programming in CircuitPython.